Hello, my friends. My name is Darren Gertis, and here are the three big stories for today. So the biggest thing is this, this uh, drone flying in, and I'm going to show you about five seconds of it, and I will not show you the impact. This is in Tardistan, and let's pause it there. We'll come back to this uh, a little bit later. Okay, 780 Russians off the battlefield, but that's not the big story. The big story is, look at, this is Andrew Perpetua. Here are the losses I could identify today. Red is Russian, blue is Ukrainian. That's pretty unbalanced uh, sort of losses for Russia as opposed to Ukraine today. Russia destroys two Ukrainian drones over Belgorod, but that wasn't the big story. The big story was actually what happened elsewhere. Ukraine apparently mounts deepest drone strike inside Russia to date. And where did it happen? In Tardistan. Where's Tardistan? The Republic of Tardistan is a long way away. This is 700 miles from the Ukrainian border. A hundred, uh, more than a thousand uh, or 1,100 kilometers from uh, the Ukraine border. And here is uh, what's causing it to accurately, accurately attack. AI-enabled drones are trying to disrupt Russia's energy uh, industry and so far it's working. I want to show you one paragraph here. They have this thing called machine vision which is a form of AI. Basically you take a model and you have a chip and you train this model to identify the geography and the targeting its navigation to. A research analyst at the Royal United Services Institute, a UK think tank said. When it's finally deployed it's able to identify where it is. It does not require any communication with satellites. It's completely autonomous and that's what's making this work. Okay, so again, uh, Rybar was talking about it and identifying all the places that have been hit by Russian, uh, by Ukrainian on Russian oil facilities. And we have another picture here from Igor Shishku. Uh, and then we have, this is the aftermath of the explosion. It was something pretty powerful. Uh, but it's, I mean, it's pretty impressive. So I try to end with something that's fun uh and here's something fun this is katerov about russian air defense i asked the russians who control air defense what they would do if a plane invaded our territory they replied that if 5,000 planes invaded our territory at the same time they will shoot them all down with the press of one button such are their capabilities our air defense is so powerful okay so <laughs> that's a good time all right thank you for your time thank you for the likes the shares, the subscribes, and the coffees. And thank you for being the kind of person that cares about Ukraine.